This is section four, number nine. It's divided into two problems. Let's do A first. A asked us to write an equation of a line that is parallel to this graph whose y-intercept is y equals mx plus b. So we want the original slope first. So this is the original slope and it's right in front here. So m is equal to negative two-thirds. Now we want to write a line here that is parallel. So we want to find a new slope. New parallel slope is the same as the original slope. So m is equal to two over thirds. Now we want to find the y value. It said, sorry, the y-intercept. It says right here, the y-intercept is three. So b is equal to three. The equation is y is equal to mx plus the y-intercept of b. Here we go, we grab this, and plug it in here. So m is gonna be equal to negative two-thirds, and then the y-intercept here is just going to be a three. Okay, there you go. And this would be the new line that is parallel to the original that has a y-intercept of three. Let's take a look at this equation here. We want to write an equation of line that is parallel to this, that passes through this point. So again, we need to first get the original slope and the original slope here, which is right here, which is three over two. Now we want to find the parallel. So let me graph this in blue. We want to find the parallel slope and the parallel slope is identical. So it's just M is equal to three over two. It's the same as the original slope. Now we want to find the Y intercept, okay? Which is the B value. To do this, we have to use a point. So X is equal to two, Y is equal to one, right? And the equation is the same as before. Y is equal to mx plus b, which is the y-intercept. Now we want to make that substitution here to solve for b. We know that the value of x, the value of y is one. That's from the point. Then we know that m is the value of three over two. And then we want to have the value of x, which is what, two, right? So now we can simplify. One is equal to three over two is just three plus, six, plus b, okay? Subtract three from both sides. This cancels, leaving you with a negative two is equal to b. So now we can write the final equation, okay? This is the equation that we want. The slope, it is the value of three over two. And the y-intercept, it is negative two. And there you go. This is the equation of the line that is parallel to the original that passes through that point.